Matt Waxler at Wheels Through Time firing the Trout, the world's only running, only known Trout motorcycle. It was found behind a wall in an apartment in Chicago, Illinois. Nobody knew it was behind the wall until they did demonstration. Or demolition took it down. And Dale's got it, or Dale, Matt's got it out running now. What he did to stop it is he pulled in a compression release, which lifts the valves up and lets the motor die. What year is that, Matt? 1916. 16 is the best estimate, best guess? Yeah, based on a few parts that were common to other makes and models, almost every piece on this motorcycle has been engineered for this bike and this bike only, aside from the seat, the carburetor, the magneto, you know, Troxel seat was kind of the standard back then. Same thing with the Chevler carburetor and the Bosch magneto. The rims are also the same type of rims that Harley or Indian would have used during the same day. So uh, based on the kind of the overall styling and then assuming that, you know, if the guy engineers his own motor and his own transmission and his own motorcycle entirely, uh, we figured he bought a brand new seat for three bucks and a brand new carburetor for $4.25 and then a new bag. So, uh, based on those things, we're able to date the bike to about a 1916. Uh, again, it's the only Traub in the world. There never was a Traub company. The way I always tell it, and the way I've always looked at it, is if the world would have been a little bit different, there might be a hundred Traubs in the parking lot, and we might all be walking around with Traub t-shirts on and get our insurance. So, really a capable, capable motorcycle that, uh, technology-wise, would have rivaled anything that was being during the same day, exactly why it went behind the wall. Um, Nobody know. knows. Yeah, we don't know. So yeah. was it just exactly like this when you?